We're here at the Thrasher Boys and Girls Club for a four-day water safety camp. The Zach Foundation was founded in 2008 after Zachary Archer Cohn um, tragically lost his life to a drowning from a drain entrapment in the family's backyard pools. Karen and Brian Cohn, Zachary's parents, started the Zach Foundation in hopes of educating um, children and families about water safety. And one of the things they have is a really great partnership with the Boys and Girls Club of America. And we put on these camps every summer. Here at Thrasher, we just reopened our pool. Having a pool here in this location is so important from the standpoint that a lot of these kids don't get an opportunity to go somewhere and swim because they can't afford it. And this allows them to come in at a reasonable price or even sometimes free to learn how to swim, which will carry them on through life. We get to swim and learn new things about kicking and kicking. We learned about um, going underwater and pushing our, pushing our feet and swimming, making our legs straight so we can kick more fast. The kids get in the water swimming lessons to increase their water competency and their swimming skills. They get a classroom curriculum that's based on the book that the Cohen family wrote called The Polar Bear Who Couldn't, Wouldn't Swim. And so they're getting a really well-rounded education on water safety so they can be safer, uh, make safer decisions around water. And then they're getting in the water uh, swimming instruction and swimming skills so they can build on those because those things together will help prevent drowning. Um, drowning is the number one cause of death for children ages one to four and the second leading cause for kids up to age 14 and remains a leading cause for older adults. The CDC just came out with some brand new information in May saying that drownings are on the rise. Sadly, we had almost 500 more drownings each year than we had in prior years. So it's things like this, educating kids to make safer decisions and have safer behaviors around water, increasing their water competency in the water, um, and then they can go home and be ambassadors to their families. The water safety education that is provided here at the Boys and Girls Club through the Zacks Foundation has been really helpful as far as the uh, kids learning the do's and don'ts of water safety and also giving them an opportunity to get in the pool and get comfortable with the water.